very difficult one for the defender to deal with. So Rangers must try and get bodies in there. Toran Duflo just holding back. Bert Conteman and Lorenzo Amoruso are up into a packed penalty box. Craig Moore is there as well. In from Kanesia. Good one from Conteman. And there's the opening goal. And it's well into Burr. Now 4 1 in aggregate. The goal Rangers desperately wanted. Seven and a half minutes gone. Well, Ronald De Boer was very, very influential in the first game at Ibrox, and he certainly really helped the situation now for Rangers. Fighting away there at the back post, gets himself a little half yard, takes a gamble, and really he can't miss. Full credit to him for getting into that position. Burke Conteman getting that initial header as well. Well, Dick Advocat enjoyed this one. This makes everyone breathe a little easier. Contemans won at the near post, got the contact, and Horniak, who'd been trying to remove Ronald De Boer's shirt by the looks of it, uh, was static as De Boer crept in, and he wasn't going to miss from there. Yeah, clever play from Ronald De Boer. And Dinamo not at all happy that a free kick wasn't given against Flo in the build-up to that chance. But full credit again to Tor Andrew Flo. It was a ball forward from uh, Barry Ferguson, eventually... Flo got his just rewards and the uh, defender falling over allowed him to get the ball and what a miss there really from Claudio Reina because that really would have tied things up. Ferguson, useful ball in, Komatowski has missed it and it's 2-0 on the night and now 5-1 overall and that's a howler by Vasily Komatowski. He was under some pressure but the ball went straight through his hands. I don't think he's got any real complaints there. Fernando Rickson has got himself into position just in front of the goalkeeper. Komatowski just makes a meal of it, and that's it. I mean, that's a perfect start now for Rangers, isn't it? So I guess this is Barry Ferguson's goal then. His cross, the goalkeeper just lets the ball skip through his gloves. Yeah, I think uh, Barry Ferguson doesn't score too many goals. I'm sure he'll be keen to claim that. So. Stefan Klaus getting things lined up in front of them. It's gone so well for Rangers so far. They would like to keep the sheet clean. And it's the skipper, Gusev, who stands over the ball. Gusev shots. Gusev's goal. Brilliant finish from the captain. Now 2-1 on the night. 5-2 overall. Well, Dick Avico will be absolutely furious with the way that that goal came about. Certainly it's an excellent execution from Gusev. Caused it as much as he could with the ball, but when the ball is hit with, the, with pace like that, flipping and curving into the bottom corner, he's not really got a chance. But again, it was sloppy Rangers uh, defensive play that allowed him to get anywhere near the goal. And you can almost see the steam coming out of Dick Avocat's ears there because that was so avoidable for Rangers it's highly unlikely he sets high standards for his players and it's uh, symptomatic of the way he operates that uh, although Rangers were two goals ahead early on he was absolutely furious at the concession of the Dinamo goal that's lovely stuff from Ronald De Boer through for flow here's a chance for number three Tori Andre Flo finishes in some style, set up by De Boer. Now 3-1 on the evening. Fabulous, fabulous goal there. And again, Ronald De Boer featuring very strongly in that. Congratulations to Tori Andre Flo as well. Superb finish. Shembaras is embarrassed here by uh, Ronald De Boer. Hasn't been able to deal with him whatsoever. Perfectly weighted pass into Tori Andre Flo. Zutautas can't get near him. And there you go, top corner. That'll do nicely. The Advocat enjoyed Tori Andrew Flo's 13th goal of the season, 13 in 16 games. He's often criticised the former Chelsea striker, but uh, he's delivered a top performance here in the first half and crowns it with the third Rangers goal. Spectacular finish it was on a difficult service. He really placed that superbly uh, into the, uh, an area of the goal in which it's going to come true, Trevor. Shot to bits once again, but uh, Tor Andrew Flo has had, a, has had a great game. I just thought he might have been kept on for the duration of this match. Good work from Flo. Finds Latapi. 
Lovenkrantz makes a good run. Excellent pass. Chance for Lovenkrantz. It's 4-1 on the night. Brilliant pass from Latifi. It was inch perfect. And that's a cool finish from Lovenkrantz. 4-1, now 7-2. Well, as simple as that, simple as that, uh, Tor Andrew Flo, excellent work to release Latby here, and that is what Russell Latby is capable of, yeah, yeah, um, yeah, great yeah, pass, yeah. Lovenkrantz pace, a little bit fortunate there with the touch uh, falling into his path, but, uh, no mistake there, just rolling the ball into the net. Doesn't feature too often in the first team, Peter Lovenkrantz, a bit part player at Ibrox. Got youth on his side, of course, and he will have loved that moment. He will have loved that goal. And while well, all that was happening, Rangers 